that I'm happy to deliver to you. I will look into different areas of your life, if you allow me, to see how you will get ahead with better finances, better health, better personal life. This card is Eight of Swords and uh, it, it is combined with Italian card from the deck that is called Sibylla. And here are some regrets. Here are some regrets. This card talks about your past. Maybe in the past you felt hurt. Maybe someone hurt you. Or circumstances were not favor favorable to you. Maybe in the past you experienced some pain. It could be emotional pain. It could be physical pain. But it is in your past. Of course, uh, it is a sad thing. We often think about what was before, what was last month or last year, and why some people might hurt us, or some people sometimes are hurting us without knowing that they do it. Eight of Swords often talks about pain, emotional or even physical. This card tells you that it is in the past. You can, you know, if you want, this card, you can use it to help you to get over this pain and get ahead with your life, no matter what. Major Arcana, very good card, that called the world. And this card talks about you in this center. You are protected. Higher power protects you. Your source, your totem, energy, your angels. And here, all the other people, all signs of zodiac, other people are outside your aura. Other people are outside your comfort zone. They cannot hurt you anymore. And maybe it was a a person, maybe a partner or someone at work or in the family who hurt you. But right now you are protected from higher power and no one can hurt you right now. You have so much strength, you have so much power, you have so much in front of you. So you can go ahead and be happy. Next card. Oh, another major arcana. This card is called Temperance. Temperance is about, of course, balance, balanced diet, balanced lifestyle. It is important to stay healthy. Also, balanced environment, where there are people whom you trust. And if you don't trust people, you, you're not in contact with them. This is the rule of life. Also, temperance is, is talking about asking your question, what is in your life that is most important? And you have to um, hold it in your heart and uh, have focus on what is the most important and what is not, you can let it go. Because the temperance card has an idea in itself that called a to temper. To temper is to purify, to get rid of something that is not useful, that is not productive that is um, holding you from getting ahead with your career or with your happy personal life. Sometimes someone, like this elephant, wants to interfere with our life, wants to tell us, us what to do. But here, it's you, this figure in, in the front of the card, telling you, keep focus on what is important and don't worry what people think of you. Because often these elephants are other people. Often people think of you whatever they like to think of themselves or don't like to think of themselves. And quite often, sometimes even all the time, whatever people think of us, it's their own business. It's their own vision of the world. And quite often it has nothing to do with us. It is all to do with them. So this card tells you don't worry about other people. Live your own life to the fullest. This is the meaning of temperance card. So next month you're going to live your life to the fullest and get ahead with your life plans, 
and you are going to be very successful. This is excellent card, Four of Pentacles and um, Fortune card. This tells you that you're going to have money, you're going to have better job, better finances, you're going to make very good purchases or sales, and you're going to be very successful with your money. Maybe you or your loved ones will get better job, and you're going to rest assured that nothing interferes between you and your goals. You can achieve any goals because you will have enough finances to achieve those goals and get ahead with your plans. Maybe some of you with this card will get better job or a better situation or maybe move to a better, more beautiful neighborhood uh, where um, people will be friendly and there will be park next to you so you can go for a walk. The job will be not far from your home. So this heart of happiness, it will bring you lots of happiness. And another one. Oh, wonderful, because it's a ship. You see, the ship is all, always about change. And this person in front is you having life opportunities. So you see, this card tells me about you and about your career or maybe about you moving to a better better place somewhere romantic or maybe it is a person with whom you will be in relationship very good person and also it's six of um, swords often talks about escape often talks about you getting out of circumstances that were not favorable to you so this card promises you solution solution out of anything that holds you. So if I look at all of these cards, I see that you're going to be happy and protected, better health. I see that you're going to have fortune, lots of money and, and good, good healthy finances. This card tells me that you're going to focus what's important and be successful. And uh, two cards of um, Swords sometimes talk about, you know, other people or difficult life circumstances. However, there is a solution, there is a change on the way, and this is a good change, positive change. Here is your spread, my dearest. If you don't know me, I am Olenka from Canada. I am happy and honored to deliver this spread for you. And my spreads usually help they give you some sort of ideas how to get where you want to go and give you motivation. Love you very much. Wish you happiness. Have a good month and see you next month. Bye for now.